Hello everyone, happy Saturday to you. I hope that you have been having a great weekend so far. I stopped by to give you some encouragement via the reading of Psalms 27. And before I read Psalms 27, I want to invite you to connect with me here in the In Faith app. Go ahead and check out my groups, my coaching services, and the posts that I put up from time to time. And I pray that everything that I do here in the In Faith app will be a blessing to you and that God will get all the glory. So let's go ahead and read Psalms 27. It says, the Lord is my light and my salvation. Whom shall I fear? The Lord is the stronghold of my life. Of whom shall I be afraid? When the wicked advance against me to devour me, it is my enemies and my foes who will stumble and fall. Though an army beseech me, my heart shall not fear. Though war break out against me, even then will I be confident. One thing I ask from the Lord, that this only do I seek, that I may dwell in the house of the Lord all the days of my life, to gaze on the beauty of the Lord and to seek him in his temple. For in the day of trouble, he will keep me safe in his dwelling. He will hide me in the shelter of his sacred tent and set me high upon a rock above my enemies who surround me. At his sacred tent, I will sacrifice with shouts of joy. I will sing and make music to the Lord. Hear my voice when I call, Lord. Be merciful to me and answer me. My heart says of you, seek his face. Your face, Lord, will I seek. Do not hide your face from me. Do not turn your servant away in anger. You have been my helper. Do not reject me or forsake me. God, my Savior, though my father and mother forsake me, the Lord will receive me. Teach me your ways, O Lord. Lead me in a straight path because of my oppressors. Do not turn me over to the desires of my foe, for false witnesses rise up against me, spouting malicious accusations. I remain confident of this. I will seek the goodness of the Lord in the land of the living. Wait for the Lord. Be strong and take heart and wait for the Lord. I've read Psalms 27 in its entirety from, I believe this is the NIV version. And I pray that this word will get down in your spirit as you have heard it. I pray that this word will bring so much comfort to you and whatever you may be going through. And so I'm going to offer up a prayer for you. Father, in the name of Jesus, I come before you and I trust you, O oh Lord God. I thank you for your word that does not return unto you void. Lord, I pray that you will bless the hearers and the doers of your word. Lord, I thank you that we can be confident in you, that we don't have to fear our enemies because we know that you have us in any given situation, any time of the day or night. Every time we cry out to you, Lord, you are there. And for that, Lord, we say thank you. And Father, I ask that you would bless the viewers with strength to run this race until the end. Lord, we will be so careful to give you all the honor, the glory, and the praise because it belongs to you. In Jesus' wonderful name, 
do I pray. Amen and amen. Well, beloved, God bless you. Thank you.